My name is Tosh Berman. My name is Luna Meno. Who is Luna Meno? Is this the title of the documentary about this person? Yes, Luna? It, yes it is. And this video is about people in the documentary Who is Luna Meno? Yes, this video is not about the me, it's about the people in the documentary. Yes. So today we talk about Amore Nosuke. He did all the graphics, he did the poster. He is a graphic artist, he's an artist. He is the ultimate dandy of all dandies. He's very dandy. To this, to this very day, still a very strict dandy aesthetic. Yes, very much. He has an aesthetic for everything. Sometimes when, he, when I visit him and he looks at me, he sort of shakes his head like, hmm. Yeah, I feel so <laughs> nervous when I see him. I have to dress like a perfect. Yes. <laughs> Totally obsessed with old American jazz. Yes. And especially swing dancing. Yes. It's called Lindy Hop. Lindy Hop. And I I think Amore and his partner in crime, Lulu, yes, definitely number one in Japan and I would I would argue that he's probably number one in other places as well. Yes, and then they organized that event. It's been for a long time. He invites dancers from other countries to come to uh, Tokyo to participate in his uh, his club. Amore, um, you can see his dancing with Lulu on, on YouTube, on various videos on YouTube, mm -hmm. if you want mm -hmm. to locate him there. That one. The Lindy Hop, it seems like a quiet boom all over the world. Yes. Paris and New York. And then an uh, uh, event in New York, Amore uh, did a big poster mm -hmm. for, for them in New York City. Yes, yeah, a big swing dance convention. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. So his artwork is more expanded and it's really wonderful. It's amazing, you know, when you go to their house, he has such an incredible vinyl record collection. Mm -hmm. I don't think there's any like rock and roll or anything like from. 60s and upward. Everything he has is like from the 1930s, the 1940s, mm -hmm. 1950s. And not only is he a great swing dancer as, as his partner Lulu, but he also has an amazing collection of that, of uh, clothing and uh, artifacts from that era, mm -hmm. the swing era. Mm -hmm. He knows more about swing music and its clothing and that whole culture more than anybody I know. Since the 80s. Since the 80s. Yes. That's amazing because I met you in 1987. So, so, uh, and I met him, I think, in uh, in 1989. I think uh, you met him at the wedding party. Yes, in Japan. Good, I think working with other people, collaborating, like for instance, for you, he collaborates very well with you. Mm -hmm. He designed your book, uh, Ring mm -hmm. Around the Collar, that mm -hmm. Tam Tam Books put out, mm -hmm. uh, which is a superb, beautiful design of a book. Mm -hmm. He and designed my whole my website. Yes. Uh, and then uh, he designed the, the band. The Sex Roba. Ah, Sex Roba. That's the first album. Mm -hmm. Yes, and uh, uh, the, the second Sex Roba album. Yeah. And, you know, he also did like interiors for restaurants. I know one restaurant in uh, Ebisu, Tokyo. Yes, Kachatola. Which has been open for years, like, mm -hmm. like decades, mm -hmm. which is very unusual in Tokyo because things, you know, open and close quite often. Mm -hmm. But that one place had a long history. Yes. Because it was his artwork on mm -hmm. the wall very important figure in our lives. Yes, very much so. And now in your life as well. Without Amore, I don't think I could exist here, right now. 
without Amore, um, I might be considered well dressed for other people, but not for Amore. <laughs> yes. I'm not good. I'm not. People think I'm well dressed, but Amore says no. You're you're fake. <laughs> and that's why I love Amore, among for other reasons. Yeah, thank you, Amore. <laughs> uh, so that's this episode of uh, Who Is Amore and Who Is a Moon and Meadow. Mm-hmm. And we will see you next time. Take care. Bye bye. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Bye.